Here at home, the Southeast Texas community is mourning the sudden loss of beloved of a beloved federal judge. 82 year old Thad Hartfield passed away late last night. Judge Hartfield was a pillar in the legal community serving in Southeast Texas courts since the 60s. Jefferson County District Attorney Keith Giblin has known Judge Hartfield for more than 30 years. The DA says they quickly became good friends. And as 12 News reporter Ebony Coleman explains tonight, the two men spent time together both in and out of the courtroom. Ebony. Sorry, Jefferson County District Attorney Keith Gibling says his friend Judge Hartfield had just gone in for a routine gallbladder surgery, and now he can't believe that his best friend is gone. Judge Hartfield was in very good health, um, uh, and I was shocked and just couldn't believe the news that I got. As Jefferson County District Attorney Keith Gibling sat in his office, he told me it's been a long and difficult day. He's still trying to understand how 82-year-old Judge Thad Hartfield, one of his best friends, is now gone. He had had some, some, some surgery and it was complications. From a glance around D.A. Giblin's office, you can see how much his 30-year friendship with Judge Hartfield meant to him. Pictures of them bonding and smiling. I was a young prosecutor at the U.S. Attorney's Office. He was a federal judge. Uh, I tried cases in his courtroom uh, on a daily basis, uh, just about. Uh, uh, we became friends. Judge Hartfield began his legal career in the 1960s, sitting in the very same seat that D.A. Gibling now sits in. That path led him to hearing cases in federal court. He was city attorney, I believe, for a while, and then he was in private practice for a while, and then he got appointed uh, by uh, Bill Clinton to the bench. Gibling has been there for Judge Hartfield's family as they cope with their loss, helping fulfill some last wishes and sorting through personal items. I helped drive his wife to the hospital in Houston. He called me and uh, told me how much he appreciated it, and we just caught up on on, uh, on funny things that's been happening over the Christmas holidays. One thing Gibling says he won't ever forget is the legacy Judge Hartfield leaves in Southeast Texas. He looked at everyone that appeared before him uh, with kindness and compassion. Uh, he saw them as people uh, uh, and not just files. Uh, uh, he, he agonized over every decision that he made, uh, hoping that it was the right decision. Uh, he was what I would consider to be the perfect judge. Gibbon said he had planned to visit Judge Hartfield in the hospital to be sworn in officially by him on New Year's Eve. Unfortunately, that will no longer be happening. Ebony Coleman, 12 News.